Cedric Nunn is a South African photographer, best known for his work depicting life in South Africa before and after the end of apartheid. He was introduced to photography by his friend Peter McKenzie, who became the first black student to study photography at the Natal Technicon. As Cedric did not have a matric, he was not eligible to study himself, but became a photography defector student as Peter shared his course notes and sneaked Cedric into the darkroom. Cedric first began taking photographs as quite an angry young activist type responding to the personal need to meaningfully articulate his growing interest in politics. He later co-founded the photographic collective of Afropix, which aspired to represent a record and vision of the country that was otherwise absent. Afropix was a very powerful tool for the anti-apartheid movement which supplied newspapers outside of South Africa with images, fueling the knowledge of injustice and helping to bring the necessary global attention that made the change possible. Cedric later served as director of the Market Photo Workshop, a photography school, gallery and project space in Johannesburg and was a member of the National Executive of the Professional Photographers of South Africa. Throughout his career, Cedric has exhibited his work at many shared exhibitions and hosted his first solo exhibition at the Guamuthe Museum in Durban. He has published many books to complement his exhibitions, such as Call and Response, which supplemented a 30-year career retrospective exhibition of the same name and served as a powerful reminder that South Africa's history haunts the present. Cedric has also created documentary films and there is frequently a documentary bubbling in the background. He has made two documentary films to date, which he conceived and directed. Cedric is committed to contributing to society through his work and the deep hope that depicting injustice is an act which challenges the status quo and helps to bring about change that will leave a positive legacy for the children of Africa.